then we go right into Mul Mantra, which is the opening composition of Japji Sahib that was channeled through the master Guru Nanak, the first light of the 10 Sikh Gurus. And Guru Nanak was given this root mantra so that all of us can feel that supporting foundation of our roots. Just as you imagine the roots of a tree going deep into the ground and supporting that tree through hundreds and even sometimes thousands of years. So we do this repetition to support ourselves within the base of our meditative consciousness to open the door into our infinity and our connection with our finite self. So the Mool Mantra, the root, Ekonka, Satna, Karita, Purik, Nirvo, Nirve, Akal Murit, Ajuni, Sebang, Guru Prasad, Jap, repeat, Ad such, Jugad such, Habhi such, Nanikahu Sibhi such, is true in the beginning, true through all the ages. The truth that we relate to is true even now and shall ever be true. So that infinite unchanging truth, we've planted our roots into that sound current, which carries us and most of all, supports us, gives us supportive strength. The third pathway is Sat Siddhi, Siddhiya Kal, Siddhiya Kal, Maha Akal, Akal Murit, Wahe Guru. And again, this is not in the Shabbat Gu, the Siddhi Guru Granth Sahib. So where it comes from is not so important as the fact that this formulation is a combination and permutation of sounds, Sat Siddhiya Kal, Sat, the truth, Siddhi, the undying, most undying, highest truth, Siddhi Akal, Maha Akal, we're praising, we're emulating, we're uh, defining something way beyond our own personal knowledge. Maybe you have a deep, deep knowledge, but we are affirming and respecting that channel and saying these words that will will calibrate once again that connection that we have with the infinite truth that truth that dwells within all creation and connects us all together whether we know or we don't know anything we affirm this presence within ourselves within each other and with the infinite in in the material world that we're blessed to live in i mean we get to live in a, a place and a space where there's abundance where there's excess where we have prosperity not everybody lives in this place so death becomes like oh don't go there but really that's what it is it's like you are already dead when you when your spirit isn't alive you may be living physically, but you know, if you're always living afraid of death because you're just busy enjoying the moment, then you're already dead. So anyway, but it is, I mean, that powerful pounding of the rhythm is a, um, it is part of that vibration which drives it into our cells because that rhythmic, balance is you know it's like feeling it if you're just if you're listening to music without rhythm then you kind of float away it's okay to float away and relax but you know when you have to live your life and you're constantly on a balancing act of living an elevated consciousness because what do you have to resist everything you know the material world is eating animals it's excess and it's debauchery, I don't know, it's like you lose your consciousness. If you're gonna drink wine and, and do any type of 
inebriation, you're losing your consciousness. So it is, it is a fine line. It's like, that's why we have the sword because the sword is, is like, it's right upon us imminently. Which way are you going to choose? Are you going to choose life or death? You've been given this life, so choose life, but refine your life so that you can feel that presence of what you were incarnated to do, which is to know your source. And your source is your soul, my soul. Everybody has a soul. And if we can celebrate that soul, then there's nothing better. <laughs> so. The next one is protection. We need protection. We need to be nurtured and supported and confirmed. So rakhe rak had rak is that protection of the infinite. Rakana had apu barian guriki peri pae kaj savarian hoa ape deal manaho navisarian sad janake sang. Pavachalatarian Sakatininda Kadusht Kinamahi Pidarian Visahi the key take Nanakumane Mahi Jisses simmer at the Sukahoi Sagale du Kajahi. This protection, this is a full Shabbat, is in the Shabbat Guru, the city Guru Granth Sahib. It will calm the what is it the um it will calm the doubt and give you the nurturing that we each need it gives us a um silencing of the ego the ego which is shouting and complaining that part of the mind not the mind that is giving us the correct direction but the mind that's just blabbing away and giving us doubt and confusion. So that protection comes through this Shabbat, the stilling of the negative ego that is written by the channel of the fourth Sikh Guru Guruna, uh, Guru Ramdas, sorry. 